darling. Now let's just check our inventory. See what we have got in the back. Our 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 inventory. Inventory shows thousands of DVDs in our storeroom, ranging from children and family to horror from old school to ultra modern and what's this you can't have future DVDs here yet because the uh, future has not happened yet so all I can say to that is dream on we have to wait for the future to happen first Mum. Yes, Lily darling? What can I do for you? Can I talk to you please? Of course you can, darling. Have a seat. So, what's on your mind? I was just up in my room sorting out some of my things and came across a dildo. Lily Rose Barrett. What's your language? But I did come across a dildo. If I have to tell you about your language again, you will get a smacked bottom and be put in a nappy. You mean you'd actually put a nappy on me for swearing? Of course you would. Stop being naughty this minute. Why are you being such a bastard? That does it. Stand up, right now. How dare you say such a horrible thing to my face. Ow. Fucking hell, mum. That fucking hurt. Bitch. You jolly well deserved it. Now lie down. What for? I warned you that if you used foul language again you would not only get a smacked bottom, but you'd be put in a nappy as well so lie down. Stay here while I go and get you a nappy. Right. Let's put this nappy on you. There. Now you're all nice and clean, and in your nappy. How long am I gonna have to wear nappies? As long as it takes for you to learn not to use bad language anymore. Not to worry though. Your nappies will be changed when needed. I could get used to it. You'll have to because you're in nappies for a while. Speaking of which I've pissed myself. Lie down and we'll change your nappy you naughty girl. Let's get this nappy changed. There, all nice and clean. Me thinks I'm gonna watch TV. Me thinks somebody needs her nappy changed again. You've just changed me. I know but you're dirty and we need to change you again. So lie down on the floor so I can change your nappy. 
Honey, what are you doing? I'm changing Lily's nappy, of course. Changing Lily's nappy? Welcome back. I missed it. So, what the Vintage Guys been up to since we last saw me? I want some answers. Okay guys, I've got a real treat for, for, for this Tom Rounds interview. Instead of interviewing a cuddly, we're going to interview the man of one segment of the show. We're going to interview the man you've just seen, Lord Vedermort. So let's give him a big hand. Welcome, Lord Vedermore. Thank you, James. It's a pleasure to be here for this interview. <sighs> so, Lord Vedermore, the question on everybody's minds is... Your origin. Where did you originally come from? Well, guys... To put that question in your minds, I guess, I originally came from the Barrett Brothers comedy show in the Harry Potter episode. But then, back then, I wore a party robe. Next question is, how long have you been in the show? Well guys, for those of you who haven't seen the show yet, I've been here all of this since the outset. Outset, even. And, uh, well... The very first episode, my sketches were the perilous parodies. Then they just became the Lord Vedermort spoofs. And then, finally, the Lord Vedermort sketches. And that's what they've been ever since. I believe the fourth season, maybe the third, I'm not quite sure when. Many, if that many, <sighs> escapes me. Next question, Lord Vedermore, I want to put to you is this. When did your robe get upgraded? For those of you who may not know this, and who will definitely be interested, my robe was upgraded to this one when James went to the Harry Potter Studios to take a tour. Came back with a robe, and the first episode he did 
was a Harry Potter special. But the first episode was named after that. I was wearing this robe for the first time. It felt great. People may be interested now, Lord Voldemort, to know why are there two sides to you? I thought this question might pop up. People, the reason why there are two sides to me is because I am a mixtape of two characters. One from Harry Potter, Harry Potter himself, and Darth Vader from Star Wars. So, when James, in the Poseidon God of War 20, steps into my shoes, he does this side of me. Darth Vader. I went down Stratton, aka Toaster Cartoons, Darren University. And um, the podcast show 2009 stepped into my dreams because the Lord Voldemort side. <sighs> now, I would have thought this was fairly explicit by the way I wear a Gryffindor robe <sighs> and a Darth Vader head. Um, see? <sighs> a mixture of two characters, and I normally wear a lightsaber in my left hand. But, we have to put that to the side for this interview. Thanks for clearing that up for him, Lord Vedermore. Now, before we end this interview, I've got to ask, are there any questions you'd like to ask me? One question crosses my mind, James. Why did you create your new YouTube channel in the first place? Good question. Um, I created this channel in the first place because I couldn't log on to my original channel, Kenny A89, due to the um, conjunction with Google and YouTube did. So I had to create this account so I could carry on making videos or start fresh Poseidon God of Water 20 has answered your question Vedermore and now we'd like to thank you for taking the time to be interviewed today you're welcome James and I'd like to thank you for having me here for this interview today. Always a pleasure, Lord Vedermore. And now it's time to sign off for this interview. So it's goodbye from me and Lord Vedermore. And one more thing. The next interview will be with me. So any questions you'd like to ask, or you'd like to see on the screen, any friends of mine who have numbers, my number, text me the question you'd like to ask and I shall answer it.